and we're live. Huh. Oh, oh, let's watch a this is crocodile a, death roll. I'm sure you guys have seen it because this is a classic in the animal fight world. This is like uh, Animal Fights 101 on YouTube. Like, it's fantastic. Right. It's pretty short. Ooh, I think I have seen this. And is this crocodile is, death roll? That's what I'm looking quick enough. Yes. Yes, it's brutal. So, and they have it on Animal Planet's YouTube channel. <laughs> Unt- <laughs> Uncut. Are you guys do ready? Do we know why this is here? Like, do we have do I have context for this? Was like, uh, it, it appears to be in like Thailand. Uh, crocodile China. bites down on a man's arm and performs a death roll during a routine stunt in this clip from Animal Planet's Untamed and Uncut. Gotcha. There's a possibility to be bit by an, a crocodile. It's not routine. But anyway, okay, let's go. Ready, set, play. All right. It's the All right. The guy's in his cute little jumpsuit, and he's about he's posing to mute it. I can't stand this fucking commentator. <laughs> He's putting his hand into the mouth of the alligator. Oh, Gosh. the asking for trouble maneuver. This crocodile's mouth is, I'm going to guess, well, this is a small Thai man, so maybe his proportions are a bit difficult to gauge. not Andre. No. They, it, its mouth is like as long as your, I don't know, two feet? It looks huge. It looks huge. Now his now it's just smaller. slapping the top of it, and I think that probably I'd say the crocodile doesn't care for that. It says this crocodile is not strictly trained. <laughs> Look at him; he's jabbing it in the mouth with a stick. Wait, a, a, a killing machine that has existed in basically the same form for millions of years is not particularly well trained. You don't say. Look, he, he oh shook no! The water off. That's a smart maneuver. He splashed it several times, he's, as he's if the crocodile give a fuck. He's gonna put his well, hand if the croc feels the water is dripping there, then it will bite. That's why he shook he, the water. He splashed it like from the little river nearby. It was earlier. I really hope we don't get close up to this guy's hand after this. Oh, it's not just his hand, my friend. Oh! Oh, oh no! Immediately. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, I watched the crocodile arm. twisted a different rotation than that guy twisted, which means Bites something didn't work. Immediately starts spinning. This yeah, guy's arm is gone. Shattered. See, he needs. Yeah, to his be... arm's gone. Like it's just totally, totally shattered. Oh, it was awful, folks. I gotta say that the shark bit down on his arm. All right, so first of all, earlier he was fucking with the shark, and the shark closed its mouth. Crocodile. But it was just, it was just fucking with him. But the, this is crocodile. But it was just fucking with him, cause, cause in the test bite, it just went chomp, like this soft little slow bite. When he actually stuck his arm in there, it shut like a vice at the speed of light. It, <laughs> and it, then it like fucking jumped. I didn't even know. I know they did death rolls, but I assumed that was like in the water or something. I didn't realize that this athletically they could just do a full <laughs> fucking three sixty flip off the ground. But you don't think of a crocodile like that, you know? It's just like, dude, I can't roll over in bed that well. And he had a guy's arm <laughs> in his mouth. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, but, but, to, but the, the part that blows... Okay, from that, the oh. funny part is the guy rotates at a different speed than the crocodile. That's how you oh, know you're yeah. fucked. That's how you're like mentally like watching that. You're like, yeah, I wasn't sure how bad it was until I watched the replay and saw that I was rotating at a pace of one revolution per X seconds. And the crocodile was going three revolutions at the same fucking time period with yeah. the arm clamped. And you see at the end, like like right before it cuts, you can see pretty much the whole area like right above the elbow is shattered and pointing in a totally different direction. It's like if you took a, a, a like a rigid thing of saltines and then you just went <laughs> and then like you could twist it and move it around. It was just it's just silly putty and paste in there. You have a new elbow. Yeah, yeah. and now you live in Thailand with one <laughs> arm and no one is going to hire you to do your crocodile shit anymore because what are you you're like about? you're going to scare the shit out of everyone. Oh, please, I'd pay do? extra. This is that a guy's new gonna advertisement become... for prosthetics. Now he is fucking immune to whatever that crocodile can do. He's like, look at my head go in. Look at my head come out. It doesn't matter. He's not worried about me. That's you great. That's a good point there. What if you recreated this every show but with a prosthetic <laughs> arm? Like, it looks real, but it's just, just he's like, okay, let's try this one more time. <laughs> oh, no! He just rips his arm off every his fucking show. His arm's coated with A1 steak sauce every show. <laughs> just, oh, that'd be how, great. How, how long would that work? They'd be like, I'm going to go see the show today of the guy who gets his arm ripped off. 100% of the time he did. I'm tired of going to here. He put the, put the hand in the mouth and nothing even happened. <laughs> it's like, no. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. I bet his career's gone downhill. <laughs> Uh, no, that yeah. was hard to watch. I didn't expect it to bite down so hard. That's I'm what, surprised. That's the part that bothered you was how hard he 
got bit. You it can almost see turning. his arm like crush in real time, like like the girth of his arm immediately halved <laughs> as <laughs> as it went there. Like that bone fucking shattered. Like, Ugh. and I don't know what the surgeons are like in Thailand, especially the ones that are able <laughs> to be, uh, uh, that are accessible to this gentleman. What kind of healthcare plan do you think they have for the crocodile teasers? Are, is one of your sponsors an insurance company this week? No. No. Are you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because I'm sensing a theme, a recurring theme across the videos we're watching right now. <laughs> it's just that if you're going to get mauled by an animal, you better have insurance. Yeah. And I don't think they did. No, no. all you get is the cool blue jumpsuit we give you. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. You can walk your ass to the hospital on your own. <laughs> you know, rickshaw, we cover that. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh man, that's fucking awesome. See, <laughs> that poor guy. I feel bad for him because you know he's somewhere with one fucking arm right fucking now. It's probably a sign up. I, when I was I was in Thailand for my uh, honeymoon, and we uh, and there were signs up on the beach. Uh, beware the Portuguese man of war, or whatever the hell it was. Mm -hmm. and like, and it's like, yeah. Beware. That, that sign's helpful. Like no one, it's not like anyone wasn't in the water. It wasn't like people were swimming. It weren't swimming in the water. But you're just supposed to be beware of it. So maybe like that's kind of how they do like the the liability, liability element of this. <laughs> yeah, there's like uh, he's in this in this thing. There's like a sign in front of it that says beware the crocodile's bite. You know, not beware the crocodile. It's specific. It tells you really what you mm. have to be you know thinking about and focused on in that situation. <laughs> but like yeah, yeah, you know, that's solid advice. I'm not worried about crocodile kicks. Yeah, I'm not either. Well, no. after yeah. that fucking jump roll off of dry land, I'm a bit more worried about that. I never I, thought I'd have to be worried about being <laughs> jump kicked by a crocodile, but <laughs> maybe you would never be in a situation where you'd be like, "Oh my god, that's a wild crocodile! I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go beat its nose around a little bit and stick my hand in its mouth." <laughs> <laughs> look at this! Look at this fucking pussy ass croc! What are you gonna do, bitch? <laughs> I'm gonna tickle your fucking uvula. Little bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, of course not. <laughs> no, uh, you, you would, you would do it. All, all three of us would do is walk to a safe distance. I, people don't well, though. My, my mother called nine one one because people were playing with the crocodile. She's in Florida, and uh, I hope I have this story right. And they're like, you know, what's the nature of your emergency? And she's like, there's tourists here posing for photos with the crocodiles or alligators or whatever they are. And they're like, ah, oh, that's not good. So they came and warned them of the danger. Yeah, they're alligators down there. Yeah, okay. that's fucked. Yeah, that's uh, Florida's a scary place. I wouldn't it's, take pictures uh, with one. They're posing. No, no, no. I don't know. It, uh, it, you got to be there to like gauge the situation for yourself, I think. You know, maybe it looks like a friendly alligator. It was on yeah, a highway a on ramp, you know, like, yeah, like see, in the grassy about, section. He's a gator about town. He's, <laughs> he's like a city chipmunk. You know, he's the Izod gator. Or, 